Hey, what's up everybody? It's me, you know me, Omi, the Jake, and welcome to another episode of Jake's Toy Box. Today, we got more mail. Yes, look at this. We got more packages right here. We got one box. We got one of these. And we have one of these. So, let's get straight, bomb, to business. We're going to open up this one with my... Trusty associate, Mr. Reza Ramon. Reza, say hello. Hello. So there he is. Okay, so we're going to open this. Yeah, once again, I'm going to go down on my knees so I can open this with ease. There you go. Put this a little bit over here. Well, I hope everybody had a great weekend. I know I did. Uh, enjoying the hell out of my collection, which is growing each and every single day i mean the love is strong and man oh man oh man it is like a tsunami of awesomeness heading this way it's like as we speak right now more stuff is heading this way it is insane it is crazy and i love it but for now i have to shut up a little bit because i have to focus on opening this one without tearing or cutting up what's inside so here we go here we go yes what is this it is a piece of cardboard it is very good here we go, like so, very carefully, like so, and boom. What we got over here? Oh, it's still stuck. Hold on. Almost there. Like a surgeon. Yeah. Here we go. Oh, more tape. More tape. Come on, man. Go like so. Go like so. Is it cheese Louise? Cheese Louise. Yes. Here we go. What we got over here is something awesome. I did not know they actually made this. It is a Princess of Power paper doll book. It is from Golden Book. Uh, it is a pre-cut fashions and two dolls, no scissor needed. Look at this. I'm going to hold it like this. A little bit more up, like so. Boom. <laughs> She's doing the hand signals again. So I'm like... <clears throat> so like so. Boom. Again. So. No. Yes? <laughs> okay. Yes. Okay. A paper doll book. What is a paper doll book, Jake? I have no clue what this is. Well, neither do I. So let's open this and see what's inside this paper book book. Uh, okay. Here we have She-Ra in her underwear. I think this is her underwear. Look. Should I? I'm going to stand like this because the light is reflecting like crazy, like a mofo. Like this? Yes. Okay. Uh, the color of a, each doll base matches the tabs on that doll's clothes. I'm, I'm, I'm reading this upside down. So, but yeah, look, you, you can punch it out and then you can use these strips so you can, uh, yeah, you, you can make her stand up. Like, like a mannequin doll. Yeah, this is like a paper mannequin doll for, for She-Ra. But yeah, look, here we have She-Ra. And this is, this is very good. This is unpunched. This has never been used. Look, here we have a She-Ra costume. And here we have, what's her nuts again? Um, I forgot her name. Post the name if you know it. And if I'm not mistaken this is one of the star sisters costume i'm not really sure uh, and here's her uh head thingy 
look at it. So what you can do, you can punch it out, and then you have to fold these little straps, the blue ones, the yellow ones, and then you can wrap it around the uh, Shira. And we, we have this one here uh, also. Oh, hold on. Hold on. Oh, there, there's a lot. Hold on. Hold on. Go like. Hi. Yeah, look. More costumes. More costumes. Look at this. Look at this. Isn't this amazing? You can dress up Shira. You can have fun with her. You can dress her up. <laughs> and you can take off her clothes. <laughs> yeah. Look at this. Look at this. This is amazing. This has never been used and it's gonna stay that way. Yes. And also we, we got um, one of these. Let's see. Oh, I'm going backwards. <sighs> botched it up a little bit. It's okay. It's gonna be a thing now. I'm just gonna botch stuff up and just gonna leave it in there. Okay, here we go, here we go. Uh, yes, look. You can also dress her up like this and like so. See, so you can either you can you can also dress her up like a unicorn. How awesome is this? And this is this is the final page. Look, there she is. There she is. Angela. That's it, Angela. And here you got some wings for Swift Wind. So, I think, ah, yes, and here we have Swift Wind. So, in, in, in order, go like so, I'm sorry, go like so. So, punch her out, punch her out, use the straps so you can display it like so, boom. But, as you can see, it's on the final page of this book and... If I wanted to punch this out, I, I I destroy the entire book. So I'm just gonna keep it like this, mint. So there you have it. This is a Princess of Power paper doll book. It has been made in the year of 1985. It's a golden book. It's a golden book. But yeah, man, <laughs> cool stuff. Cool stuff. I'm just gonna put this one over here so you can zoom in a little bit on it. So I will open the other package. Well, y'all can drool over that one. Uh, here we go. I'm just gonna cut it open like so. A little bit like so. Come on. Come on, get out of there. You need to breathe. You need to breathe. Yes, 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 yes. It is another annual. And I've noticed on Facebook, on the Motu 2.0 and other Motu fan pages that lately the annuals are becoming a, a hype. It's like everybody's getting them in. Everybody's hunting them down. So here we have a Shira Princess of Power annual from the year 1988. Can you see it correctly? All right, look, boom. This is the front. This is the back, same print. And you also got a little bit of, oh, look at this. I'm just gonna stand like so, but oh, it is a little bit damaged, but that's okay. We can, we can, we can fix this. We can fix this. I'm gonna be very careful with this one. So, so you got, yet again, stories and if I'm not mistaken, you also got some activities. Oh, look, this guy looks like the dude from, um, what's that old video game? I, I don't know, King, King's Lair, I think. I'm not sure. I don't know. Who cares? But anyway, you got this awesome stuff. And, oh, is Bo slapping the bejesus out of her? Look at that. Oh, wait, like this, boom. What's going on on this panel? Buy this book and find out. I'm not gonna spoil it. Oh, look, you got the Volcanic Voyage. You can play little games here, like so. And 
Yeah. So. Cool stuff. Cool stuff. It's a shame it's a little bit, uh, got a little wear and tear, but it's okay. It's okay. I'm just going to put this one down there. It's the Shira Princess of Power Annual from 1988. The annual collection is starting to grow because this one, you have seen this one. This one is from 1987. And this is from 88. Boom. Boom. There you go. Ah, <laughs> enjoy. So yeah, let's go uh, to the final package. And this is gonna be great. This is gonna be great because I already know what's in this. And where is the opening? Somewhere around here, I guess. And this is cool. This is cool. I wanted this because. Uh, I have overslept a couple of times. I almost uh, arrived too late at my work, which I, uh, it, that's not good. That's not good. So now I got this and uh, this will make sure I wake up on time so I can get to work on time. And what the hell's going on here? Razor, where are you? Up oh, right here. Boom. I need this. I need to open this. How the hell is this? Is this a box in a box thing again? Jesus. I think it is, you guys. Okay. So let's transform. Open. What is? It? Yeah, yeah. That. Paper, papers, papers. Yes. Look at this. Look at this. Open this up a little bit, like so. A little bit. Like so. Well, the guy who packed this in did a good job because it's good, it's good. Okay, we are here, we are now. This is awesome, this is wow. We have a alarm clock from Masters of the Universe. Here, hold it like, hold it like so. Look at this, you guys. It's an alarm clock with, with, with actual ding, ding, dings. Sweet. Can't wait to, uh, to test this puppy out. It's from 1983, according to this little thing here. But yeah, look, man, it's ancient. It doesn't need batteries. No, it doesn't need batteries. You can wind it up. You can set the alarm and you're ready to go to jump out of bed on time with a heart attack. There you go. Masters of the Universe alarm clock from 1983. This is awesome. I like this one. I'm going to put this next to my bed, next to where I sleep, right here. I'm going to go like so. Look, this is where I sleep. This is my pillow. Uh, I'm gonna put it right here. Boom. You know, I'm just gonna clean this up a little bit. But yeah, this is where I sleep. See, you got you got the record player. You got some uh, manga books. You got some other uh, cool stuff. But here's my alarm clock. I'm good. I'm set. I'm ready. So all I gotta do is go to bed, set this thing, and uh, see what happens tomorrow morning. Yes. So, if you all enjoyed watching this video, give the video a like. If you want to share the video, share the video. And uh, thank you all for watching. Head over to my Facebook page, head over to my YouTube channel. And I'll see you all next time. And for now, happy hunting, and thanks for watching. All right, everybody.
Peace out.